Novena to Saints Peter and Paul Let us begin the Novena for day 3 In the name of the Father and the Son and of the Holy Spirit Amen Dear Saint Peter and Saint Paul you faced opposition hatred and violence all because you believed in Christ pray for us Saint Paul with every person you persecuted, you were also persecuting Christ. We know that this hurt our Lord immensely. We also know that there are things in our lives that we do that hurt Him. Help us to reflect on these things and to repent. Please pray that we can make the necessary changes in our lives so that we, like you, can live in unity with Christ and do his work every day. Saint Peter and Saint Paul pray that we have the strength to amend our lives and to follow God's will. Lord, please forgive us and guide us. Saint Peter and Saint Paul, please pray for my intentions. In the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Novena Prayer to Saints Peter and Paul. O Holy Apostles Peter and Paul, I choose you this day and forever to be my special patrons and advocates. Thee, Saint Peter, Prince of the Apostles, because thou art the rock upon which Almighty God hath built his church. Thee, Saint Paul, because thou was forechosen by God as a vessel of election and the preacher of truth in the whole world. Obtain for me, I pray you, lively faith, firm hope and burning love, complete detachment from myself, contempt of the world, patience in adversity, humility in prosperity, attention in prayer, purity of heart, a right intention in all my works, diligence in fulfilling the duties of my state of life, constancy in my resolutions, resignation to the will of God, and perseverance in the grace of God even unto death, that so, by means of your intercession and your glorious merits, I may be able to overcome the temptations of the world the flesh and the devil, and may be made worthy to appear before the chief and eternal shepherd of souls, Jesus Christ, who with the Father and the Holy Spirit lived and reigned for endless ages, to enjoy his presence and love him forever. Amen. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation but deliver us from all evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you amongst women and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Thou shalt make them princes over all the earth. They shall be mindful of thy name, O Lord. Concluding prayer, O God, whose right hand raised up blessed Peter when he walked upon the water and began to sink, and thrice delivered his fellow apostle Paul from the depths of the sea when he suffered shipwreck. Graciously hear us and grant us by the merits of them both that we may also attain unto everlasting glory, who lived and reigned world without end. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, 
as it was in the beginning is now and ever shall be world without end amen <laughs>